Friends, before uh, we have learned the weighted index number, I hope you remember the method which calculated with the help of W. Uh, what is that W? W means the weightage given. Uh, in the previous uh, questions also, sometimes weightage, that is W, is being mentioned in few of the questions. Make sure weightage was also used in your standard 11th for finding the weighted mean. The weighted here means the new price and the old price have a proportion. Let's have a look at it. When we talk about the prices, sometimes the textbook changes the question. We talk about old price, new price. The textbook poses this question in a different way. The old death ratio and new death ratio. See, it's ultimately it's the same. It is nothing but the finding the index in various ways. Our prices will compare the index buying it. Quantity compare karenge index pata chalega, birth rate compare karenge index pata chalega, death rate compare karenge index pata chalega. Bhoot sari aise cheez hai jisko compare karenge se, yani old versus new karenge se, aapko nai index pata chal sakte hai. Let's have a look at it, what do they mean to say? Illustration 16 mein agar aap dhyan se dekhe, to ek bada sa paragraph 4 file lines ka bhar ke diya hua hai. But that paragraph, that blah blah is nothing but to understand only two points. Unhone kuch 2003 ki population count kiye the, uska weightage diya hua hai. 2003 में कुछ नंबर ऑफ डेथ थे 2008 में भी कुछ नंबर ऑफ डेथ मेंशन किए हुए हैं वी शुड नो ओनली व्हाट इज ओल्ड एंड व्हाट इज न्यू मेक श्योर 2003 एंड 2008 व्हिच वन इज ओल्ड करेक्ट 3 दिस इज न्यू बट दे हैव गिवन अगेन 2003 बट दिस इज पॉपुलेशन एंड दे हैव स्पेसिफिकली मेंशन इन द क्वेश्चन इटसेल्फ दैट Take 2003 population as a weight, which means in this question we are not supposed, we are not expected to find weight. Weight is already given and assigned. Now we are supposed to find out which one is old, which one is new. This is the old death, this is the new number of death, which means this is considering the old price this is the new price and how can we relate old and new if you want to find out the index you are supposed to do only simplest thing new price upon old price which means new price upon old price which means it goes like this 65 Divide by 200, multiply by 100. Similarly, 100, divide by 145, multiply by 100. See, why are we doing this rigorous exercises line by line? Just to understand the things very clearly, we should not mistake about chain base, fixed base index. No confusion about that. This is all together finding the weightage and indices so make sure in methods ko dusre methods ke saath merge up ya mixed up nahi karna hai so this is going to give you the indices you know how to find the index right just learn it yourself what is index index is nothing but new price upon old price into 100 new price upon old price into 100 new death upon old number of death into 100 weight is already given weight is already given which means w is already available make sure i will be found out and already ready data is given about w w is how much 10 8 48 likewise right so i'm just rewriting for the purpose of clarity press 10 8 sorry the number second is 8 then 48 manage your space easily in the notebook which is simple to understand and this is weight and along with we are supposed to find the i what is the first index 65 into 100 divide by 200 if you multiply in the calculator if you try to calculate the things you can get the new numbers right the new number is going to be 32.5 make sure you go to at least two digits when they are again 100 into 100 divided by 145 right so let's go with this indexes also Right, which we had previously calculated with me 68.97 you can do it with calculators next is 78 point approximate it's going to be 70 or around it's going to be 69 
next number would be 64.30 or ideally it is 29 and the last number should be 84 not 56 it should be 84.55 so this is indices how can you find just division and multiplication i ready w is also ready so you are just need to multiply i into w nothing but this is the weighted index weighted index if you remember the weighted mean it was multiplication of w i into x i right now it is multiplication of w into i so 10 into 30.2.5 shall give you 325 similarly 68.97 into 8 can you multiply this it's very simple you can do this right 68.97 into 8 shall be 551.76 go ahead again multiply how much shall it give you three triple seven point twelve similarly sixty four point two nine multiplied by thirty eight so two double four three point zero two and last multiplication eighty four point fifty five multiplied by fourteen shall give you eleven eighty three point Seven. Clear? So now only the final step streaming. It's very easy. IW need to be total and W need to be total. Don't touch this one. Only IW should be total, which comes to 8280.6 approximately. And the W total comes to 118. If you recollect or recall the formula the weighted index number formula is remember that yeah sigma i w upon sigma w sigma i w means the total of this 8280.6 upon sigma w that is w is total 118 so 8280.6 divided by 118 shall give you around 70.17 or 18 Friends, do you know this answer is below 100? If you observe this, this is below 100. You know, we find out increase. How do we find increase? If it is above 100, we call it as an increase of inflation. This is below 100. This is nothing but decrease. And decrease, how much is the decrease? Very easily can you find its decrease is equal to. Just deduct this number from 100. If you increase the increase, if you increase the increase, the increase will decrease. Hai. So, so minus 70.17 shall give you the answer around 29.83. So, this is the net decrease which is asked in the question. Make sure whenever the question is given about old price, new price, old quantity, new quantity, you can always find out with the help of old price and new price you can find out the indices that is i i is available with p1 upon p0 into 100 and this was the base which is declared already in the front paragraph of this illustration make sure you have to read the question carefully and then after you should start solving it because the front paragraph clearly says apart from all other stories given clearly says that 2003 population should be taken as base that is a weightage so we have taken it as a weight this is p0 this is p1 and we have made i and w out of this this is nothing but the weighted index numbers which is called otherwise called cost of living index numbers also right okay so practice more on this topic is it clear